Well, hey, YouTube, it has been a long time. I keep saying I'm going to do the NACA video over and over, and I do apologize for the delay. It's just been a lot going on. Nothing bad, just trying to keep up with my two jobs. I got a new first job, then I had to get a colonoscopy, and then I'm traveling, and I've had a couple of new clients. Um uh, I got um, I got that booster shot that had me a little down, just a little. It's just been a lot, so forgive me for the delay, but here I am. I am Tammy C. Walker, the owner of Dreams Are a Reality. This is my great channel. When I created this channel, I created it for light and love to inspire others, to show them that you can have the life you deserve. You can have the property, the home, the marriage, the kids the career, the business, the income, whatever you so desire. I have gotten into this NACA program, um, the Neighborhood Assistance Corporation of America. It's a good program to help, you know, people qualify for a home. It's not necessarily no money down. It is like no money down for your down payment, but you do have to come up with other monies. But that part is okay because they are going to walk you through the program. And if you have been following my channel as well as other great NACA videos, you do know that the first step is to go to that workshop. I think some could be in person now. I'm not for sure. Mine was on video on Zoom back in February. Then I had a meeting with my NACA counselor, my first one that was in March. I'm doing my video today for my second one that was April 29th. So this is the NACA update. I met with my counselor for my second meeting on April 29th. Oh, I, like I just, sorry, I'm going to be repeating myself because sometimes I'm going from memory, but I already have it on the slide. Again, sign up for your workshop. I had mine February 2022. It was on Zoom. It was over 300 and something of us on that Zoom. It was very informative. Please stay until the end of your workshop and get your code. This will give you access to your web file. This is where you're going to upload all of your documents. So please pay good attention. Don't panic. Don't worry about your credit score and all that. They don't only go by credit score. So this is why you have to pay attention and follow the steps. NACA, N-A-C-A dot com. Go there, sign up for the workshop. Hopefully you can get in for, see, this is May, June's workshop, I hope. Okay, then, like I told you, I had my first meeting in March. At the end of March with my counselor, it's going to be long, your first meeting, probably two hours or more. So make sure you book a good three, three and a half hours because it's thorough. The second meeting won't be nowhere near as long because you'll have your groundwork done. So let me just kind of graze over this because I'm kind of repeating things twice. But before I got to my meeting in April, she had already given me a plan. You're going to have what's called a, an action plan. So my action plan, I was supposed to add my March and April bank statements, my budget form, from April, I have three credit cards that I need to bring to zero, in which so far now I have paid off two. Um, at this time, I had one, but now I have two at zero, and I'm still working on the third one. And I just made sure my employment history was uh, correct, my landlord history was uploaded, my divorce papers were uploaded. These are the things I had to work on. They wanted to know why I had a credit inquiry. I bought a treadmill and because it was, you know, a decent amount, I just financed it. Um, savings. I was not doing that correctly. I was supposed to be sending my shock payment to my savings account every month and I did not follow that. So I learned that at the second meeting. I uploaded the student loan income driven statements. So these are the action plan items I had to address. Don't worry, you're going to get a list. And if you're like me, just work on your list. And I kind of highlight my stuff as I go. Um, it keeps me accountable. So keep looking at your list. If you know you're going to meet with your NACA person at the end of June, you want to have everything ready. You don't want to waste their time. And then if you don't have your stuff ready, they're going to think you're not serious. 
So I also had an old account I was late making a payment with. I had to, to explain that. I had two other accounts I was late with. I had to explain that. One was written off years ago. I had to upload my pay stubs and keep doing that until you get finished with, you know, once your application is turned in, you can stop doing that. So what I'm saying with that payment shock, let's say my rent is $1,500, but I want my mortgage to be $1,700, $200 over. Every month when I get paid, I need to have that $200 go in there. I can do $100 each pay period or $200 you know, out of one check, however I want to do it. They need to see that extra money. Yes, Tammy can't afford a mortgage for $1,700. So at the end of the meeting, we discussed the bank statements. I'm a spender at times. And if I'm putting in 5000 a month, I can't keep spending like 4700 It doesn't look good. I need to have at least some savings. Well, at least it's at 4700 will give me $300. But I need to make sure I have extra money. So I got to really watch that because the statements we're going to use for my application is June, July, and August. So, you know, my stuff got to be tight and right. We plan on putting through my application in August. I just got to make sure I have my money needed. I'm still saving. So, okay. And this is kind of a repeat, but that's the shock payment. If your mortgage is your rent right now is thirteen hundred, but you want your house to be fifteen hundred, keep socking away that two hundred dollars per month to show that you can afford this higher mortgage. Continuous action items that I must do until my next July 29th meeting. I need to keep updating these bank statements. So by then it'll be May, June, because I'll be hitting the end of July. I'm gonna upload all those bank statements. We would, won't be using May, but we're going to definitely use June and July for submittal because um, they need three months worth. And you want your statements, again, to look like you have not spent everything that you earn. Um, I have to keep updating my credit card statements every month. You want to do that. Um, and I, like I just told you, I had three credit cards I need to pay off. I have paid off two. So I need to upload the statements that show a zero amount. I already uploaded my divorce papers there. It's a horrible copy. I got divorced in 1999. It's a chance I may have to get a better version of those papers. I already did that late payment explanation that I told you about. This is kind of a repeat. Okay, so they are going to want you to do a participation. I chose to upload a post to my Twitter. I have like 4,000 Twitter followers. No, maybe 3,000. But I posted like something about NACA on my Twitter. And secondly, I did a Google review about NACA Chicago. So those are my two participation things that I did. I'll have to do some more things. But those were two that I did right away. I already said, keep uploading your pay statements every other week or every week, however you get paid until you submit this application so these are repeat 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 um once you get ready to have your application submitted you must have that minimum required funds just say six thousand dollars you gotta have it it is oh man i kind of cut this off a little bit you all I'm sorry, I really need to open this slide up so you can see it a little better. But I'm scared I'm going to mess it up if I... Let me see here. I don't think I could do anything. I'm sorry. Oh, no, that's not going to help. Yeah, I needed you all to see that better. Nope, there's nothing I could do. So I will try. I made it worse. Ha <laughs> ha. I made it worse, you all. Let me just try to work with what I got. So they'll say like no money down, but you do need money down because you have to pay for your inspection, your taxes, your honest money, your homeowner's insurance, your mortgage insurance. You do need to have money. They're going to tell you the amount. So don't get discouraged. Um, and if you don't have it, just get, maybe give yourself three, four, five months to have it. Um, you could come up with the money. You can't get it as a gift from a family member. 
So don't get discouraged. Or you might have it in your 401k. You can use that too. So don't get discouraged over that money part. Let's see here. Oh, Lord, that's it, you guys. So I hope that made sense. What I was saying pretty much is maintenance. You know, you do that first workshop. The second one is, or sec, I'm sorry, you do the workshop, step one. Step two is the counselor. That is going to take time. Allow three, three and a half hours. It's going to be thorough. Get everything in order. That will give you your action plan. Once you get the action plan, it's maintenance, uploading things, uploading things they need, and be careful with your spending. Don't overspend. Don't overspend. Don't overspend. Be, be conscientious of it. Be mindful. And then hopefully three, four months, you can get your application submitted. Does not take a year. Does not take two years. It's up to us to do the work. And, you know, hopefully, preferably, you'll have a counselor that stays on board or that's been with the company for a little while. I think that's been some of the problems. Some people have said their counselor change, and I get it. It's nothing's perfect, and I'm not saying NACA is. But I really like so far what I've seen. I'm very happy. I feel like I'm on my way. And, you know, it's making me even more accountable about my spending and my budgeting. So um, I hope it helps you. Don't worry if your credit score is a little low. They don't go by only the credit score. They go by employment, credit, your income. It's all encompassing. So they'll work with you. They'll tell you what you need to do. Okay, you all. I hope you all enjoyed my video. Drop me comments. Hit that like button. Hit subscribe. You all ask questions. Anybody will tell you that's on my channel, I will get you an answer. Uh, I love giving answers. I love helping. All right. I'm Tammy Sharice Walker. And I guess that's all I have. I'll be back. So my next meeting is in July. That seems like a ways away. I may end up doing the video in between, maybe giving out more tips because that's a little ways away. Okay. Have a good one. Thank you all for watching. Bye.